How come it's easier to remember facts about sharks? How come it's easier to remember that stuff than like, um, putting your dish in the dishwasher? <laughs> well, um, putting your dish in the dishwasher is really hard. <laughs> and remembering all that stuff isn't as hard, so that's kind of how I remember it. <laughs> I'm gonna give you these Legos right now. You okay. fi finally get to see them. With these Legos, I want you to create something that you care about. Okay. So, let me start this timer, and you can go ahead and start building. Right, now I'm just making the body of a shark. And right now I'm trying to find two kind of short pieces that will go right there. And then I need... How hard is it to sit still? Really hard. Can you ask some questions about sharks? I don't know, I really don't like all the different types of carpet sharks that live on the bottom. All they do is like eat. Eat from the floor. Uh, probably the tiger shark. That shark, well, it can get up to like 20 feet in 1,500 pounds, and it's a really aggressive shark. Aggressive against who? Uh, it's food like turtles and stuff like that. They're actually not like aggressive against us. Against humans? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Do they not attack humans at all? Well, sometimes like they mistake your jewelry for a fish or like something like that or like if you're surfing, they can like mistake you for a seal or something. For a seal? Or something like that if you're surfing in on the top of the water. Well, you'd have to get a big tank. We could put it in the backyard. It would take up the whole backyard. And then we would have a bunch of snorkeling stuff. Yeah, maybe a tiger or a bull shark. Or a lemon shark. Those are good. Uh, this, is it, this is its tail. These are the pectoral fins. And then this is gonna be the head and then I'm gonna make the shark holding a hockey stick. I forgot its name, but I'm pretty sure there is one. Uh, cause hockey is, I like physical sports and like hockey is, and hockey is fun. Like you get to ice skate and shoot pucks like wow. Everything is happening. N probably not. I, it would like, I'll play, but I just won't like, like probably not go to the NHL or anything. No, Alligator. probably not, no. Yeah, I don't think so. Either. They've, outlived dinosaurs and they have like a bunch of cool stuff like a four chambered heart like they can pump blood to whatever spot they want to yeah like if they lose a limb they can just pump high oxygen blood to that spot it works like there's four chambers and then most reptiles only have three. Like that's a human, like humans have four chambered hearts. And then it just, like their brain has a connection and then it just,
pumps blood to whatever spot it wants to. That green piece is gonna be the arm. Mm -hmm. And then I need another one like that for the leg. I did a bunch of stuff in books. You go to the library? Yeah, and then our school has a bunch of books. Do you have a favorite library in Spokane? No. Well, none of them have really arms except Crocodile has like little stubs. So the crocodile would win. Yeah, probably. Because sharks don't have arms. If it was like, if both of the animals were underwater, I bet the tiger shark would win. Because, like, I mean, tiger sharks have mouths that are huge. So this is a tiger shark. I made it because tiger sharks usually have like a longer tail. And then this crocodile is more like a Nile crocodile because it's really fat. And then this is like a whale heart because uh, it's big. And then this crocodile is um, probably the northern crocodile because it has a really long tail. And then this is probably like, probably a northern crocodile too because it's really skinny. And then this is a C is a CCM hockey stick. And then this is Maggie or dog because she has a big butt and then <laughs> a big head. And then this is probably a saltwater crocodile because it's so big and fat. Okay, that's it. Well, goodbye, fellow humans. <laughs>